Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Mountain Blade Warband. Let's get back into it. Mathis Gameson, out in the north, hiding from the war. We're really just waiting at this point for uh, Swadia to fall apart. Uh, we just need them to fall apart as soon as they can. Uh, in hopes that we can kind of do our own thing. I mean, if you take a look, uh, it's really going to be the Nords and the Rodoks that are going to dominate the land pretty heavily. Um, even down here, uh, these guys are getting picked apart pretty quickly. Um, these guys are doing pretty well, and the Vagars are just kind of neutral in what they're doing. Um, so we're just going to keep waiting and, and hoping that they do eventually fall to nothingness and we can go leave the alliance that we currently are in with the Swadian Kingdom. It's, it's so sad because Swadia was just such a wonderful place to get our start and did, it did us such, uh, such many favors in the time that we spent there, but... Sadly, not any longer. All right, let's buy some bread. Just a little bit of bread. Keep our men fed to the best of our ability. And uh, continue to hunt and kill bandits to make our men hardened soldiers so when the time does come, we can do something with them. And they're not just pathetic, useless people. Uh, so let's keep looking around. And uh, see what we can see. And that was deserters. I'm actually going to hunt them down. Uh, we are free brothers. When I'm done with you, you'll ever regret leaving your army. They have four men. Let's just charge them. Like, four dudes. That's it. Why am I even fighting it? Like, <laughs> how are they even still alive? It is just straight charge them. There's no re reason to do anything else. I like how these guys are rather brave, though. Instead of just retreating immediately, they're just like, you know what? F it. Let's attack. And so we shall. Let's, uh, leave them range. I like one of our guys is riding a friggin' donkey. Yep, down they go. Did we do it, man? Is still somebody alive? Wow. And he's doing some damage, probably. Oh, nope, he's done now. And this guy's just getting freaking wrecked. Yay, we did it! Good job, men! Somehow, they, they... They fought us, and I don't know why. I shouldn't even say somehow. I just say, for some reason... Well, that went well. Capture a couple of them. Be done with them. Got some money for it, too. You're welcome. Anything? Anything at all? Guess we should just look around and hunt. Hopefully we can. Uh, actually, I'll check something for a second. There is an option somebody said I should do, and I don't know. I'm going to take this off and put that on. Enemy health bars instead. Uh, hmm. Yes. This is what I was saying. I should just put this pause at hostiles during fast travel. That way we don't have to worry about getting stopped during fast travel when there are hostiles around. And there are enemies on the horizon. And deserters. How's our character, by the way? Have I leveled? I have not. So let's just go and attack these deserters if we can. Yeah, nice and easy. Once again, we'll just charge them. There's no need not to. It's 83 versus 14. We could even probably just wait for them to charge into us, but... Not gonna, not gonna concern ourselves with it too much. Just take care of them. More experience for my men. Go, cavalry! Be brave. And do what you must. You know what? Yeah, let's... While, while our men actually do that, let's, uh... Let's actually do a little bit of bow and arrow action. Can't see Jack, but let's see if we can maybe hit them. We might actually hit the horses, but I'm really not terribly concerned. Yeah, the more we can do, the better. The more experience in the archery, the better. Nothing. Who are we going after? They're all over there. Hopefully we get... Oh, that was almost a hit. Uh, oh, I think I got somebody. Yeah, I got somebody. I don't know if it was my own man, but it said I killed somebody. i just go for that horse. Slash donkey. Eh. Come on, guys. Finish, finish the attack. Good job, men. Proud of you. What, we lost one? 
Wow. Unfortunate. Oh, I meant to capture him. Oh, well. What do we got? We'll sell this. These guys had a surprising amount of gear. Truly. Grab all of it. Wow, these guys had a lot of garbage. It's better than nothing, I guess. Alright. Let's see. Some soldiers are ready to upgrade. That's good. Some self-bow archers. One self-bow archer. Slave driver. Uh, commit. More archers. Slave driver to slave hunter. We need more cavalry, so we might as well slap him on a horse. Rodok, stay as archer. You're good to go. All right, I don't want to stay in this land too long. Hopefully we'll get the peace thing. Has decided to... Da -da. For some reason... King, isn't King Harlow still, like, imprisoned? Let's see if we can figure that out. This is being looted. So we're still at war with the Nords, which is the shitty part. Still losing a little bit of money. Not terrible. Enemies on the horizon. More deserters. We'll go after them. If we can. More enemies on the horizon. Well, that's where I turn around. Get the F out of Dodge. Don't want to deal with them. Let's see if we can get into Praven. Is it still being sieged? It is not. If we can get our king. If we can get to the king and just kind of say, hey, I don't want to be your slave anymore. Then I'll be happy. That's a lot of deserters. Let's get out of there. Uh, he is not really anybody I'm concerned about. He is somebody I'm concerned about. And he doesn't want to fight, so that's fine. But I might have wanted to. Let's keep moving. More forest bandits. Uh, could fight them. Forest bandits are always good to kind of uh, get some practice on. Of course, there's going to be a lot of enemies on the horizon. That's fine. Uh, another fool to throw himself on the weapon. That's what he thinks. That's fine. That's what he wishes to think. Uh, let's go ahead and F1. Not F1. One, formation orders, advance 10 paces. We'll just wait here for them. Nice militia wall. Good job, men. They're, bar they're merely bandits. And I will tell you, I've never lost an army to bandits. And yes, I know that's a lie. But they don't know it's a lie, so don't tell them. We'll have the cavalry charge them shortly. Cavalry. We'll have them, uh... Yeah, I hit somebody. Maybe not. I hit somebody now. Charge, cavalry. Hey, the health bars are there, finally. Why can I not see anything? There we go. Now I can. I think I just hit a horse. Ooh, did I actually hit him? Thought I might have. Oh, I got him. The uh, the enemy health bar is way better than having ally health bars, by the way. For those who were saying that before, you're absolutely right. Let's go ahead and take out our sword and take out the last one. It was way out there. Probably running? No, nope, running toward us like a moron. Totally all right with that, though. Free win's a free win. And he's just gonna go down, isn't he? No? Come on, guys. There you go. You got him. Nice job. All right, relax. No casualties. A few bandits to, s oh, there's somebody there. Oh, well. The upgrade. Let my companions grab it all. Continue on to Praven. 
Or hopefully the king has escaped or something. Enemies on the horizon, where? 83 out of 84. He's patrolling. Alright, first to the tavern, see if we can sell off these prisoners. Anybody here to sell prisoners too? Hero Nadia. Who is after you? My father, my brother, the village elder, everyone! They're searching for me since I ran away. It was awful, sir. The elder, he's mad, I say to you. For the past three years, he has taken a new woman every night, only to hang her in the morning. Both my elder sisters have died by his hands already. Every woman in the land is terrified. One evening, my father had uttered the words I had feared for months. Tonight, my dear Nadia, it will be your turn. How could he say that? How could he lead me to certain death? I screamed and kicked so that both my father and brother had to drag me out of the house. I was wild in the struggle. I hit knocked over an oil lamp. The leaking oil lit a fire in an instant. I used to panic my movement. Um, blah, blah, blah. Really? Do you really want to help me? Thank the heavens that I met you. And blessed be the soul for your kindness. If I could stay with you, no one would dare harm me. I'll do my best to help around you. All right, well, welcome to my company. You were free. I'll take you. We'll take a look at your stuff after. Uh, let's see. We have a deal. Let's go to the castle and see if the king is here. Hopefully he is. It looks like he is. Oh, boy. Kingy, my friend, you are not going to be happy. Um. Yeah, I don't have a thief. Uh. Has Yoth become burdensome, math this game said is unusual to request release from homage, but in respect of your fine service, I will not hold you if you truly do wish to end it. It is something I must do, my lord. He's surrendering to me all the feasts which you hold to me. Yes, my lord. Wow, he went to negative two. Wow. Okay, well, I am finally free of his tyranny. We now can officially make our way to the north. And hope that that actually works out for us. Uh, let's go ahead to the goods merchant. Let's buy some. Let's sell garbage first. All this garbage. And we're gonna work on getting the king of the Nords to like us. We're gonna become Nordish. Again, we're just mercenaries. It doesn't really matter to us. We took the first opportunity to make a name for ourselves, and though it wasn't a terrible decision, because it did, you know, offer us a lot of experience, and I did learn a few things. Um, it was not the best decision, to put, it, to put it lightly, so. It was nice, my friends, it was nice, but it's time to go. And we no longer have anger, hopefully, toward them. So, with that being said, we need to figure out who is the leader of the Nords. What is his name and who is he? It was nice, it really was, it was so nice. Kingdom of the Nords, we're moving north permanently, friends. I hope it ends up paying off for us. Let's actually go to Sargon. Uh, a tournament in Nara. We have other business to attend to, unfortunately. So no Nara tournament for now. All right, not really worried about it. To the Nordish lands. Let's actually take a look and see if we can actually help him out. And a noble right away. How much do they hate us? He doesn't hate us. That's awesome. Uh, there's something I wish to discuss to you in private. Do you have any tasks for me? As it happens, I promised Kronoraganar I would hire a company of mercenaries for an upcoming campaign. Wow, that was quick. I, I'll join the Kingdom of the Nords. Perfect. Of course, you shall have to make a formal declaration of allegiance and give your oath that you and your company will remain in service to the Kingdom of the Nords for a period of no less than one month. Is that this guy the, the leader? All right, so everybody else hates me. Swadia despises me. I, <laughs> I was like this this lord in Swadia, and I'm like, I'm sorry, my lord. It was wonderful serving you. I have to leave. I'm sorry. And then I just walk next door, and I'm like to their neighbor, who they, you know, this is feud they have over the fence, over the wooden fence. I'm like, excuse me, can I work for you? I hear you pay well. <laughs> and now I'm here. Uh, now as you just prepare for a serious campaign, train and equip your soldiers as best you can. In the meantime, respond quickly when you're summoned for duty. Well, there we go. Uh, do you have any tasks for me? I have something you could help me with. He mur uh, an issue with a lawless villain known as Tarl of Wurchag. He murdered one of my men and has been on the run for his judgment ever since. I can't let him get away in avoiding justice, so I've put a bounty of 300 dinars on his head. Friends of the murdered man reckon that his assassin may have taken his refugee to the kinsman at Rizzi. Rizzi it is. 
Rizzy it is. Well, that was really quick. We actually did a really good job just getting right back into it. So let's go to notes, locations. I'm feeling good again, suddenly. This might not be complete waste. So let's go to Rizzy. We are now part of the part of the Nordish people. We can help them out. Hopefully they'll call me to, to arms sooner rather than later. I'm going to start looting the shit out of Swadia. Hey, look, you got to do what you got to do. Enemies on the horizon, where? Probably some... Oh, look at them. Jesus, there's a lot of them. Uh, the realm. Ragnar's decided to confer. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Rizzy, go to the village center. All right, we're here to find Douchebag McNasty. We have two of our dudes with us. Uh, I can't remember his name, but we're looking for him. Hunt down Tarl. Tarl of Wurchag. Do you have you perhaps seen Tarl? Hello. Uh. All right. Well, it's gonna be one of those just look for him situations. So let's go ahead and do that. Making a name for our, ourselves amongst the Nordish people. Might as well. Is there anywhere he could have gone? Let's go on this hill real quick. See, overlook it. See if there's any buildings down there or something that I need to see. No. No buildings. Tarl of Wurchag. We've only been a bounty hunter once. Looking for a criminal to kind of take care of, but... He was actually kind of a pain in the dick to find, if I remember correctly. But this is a different town layout, too, so... Maybe over here by this campfire. I swear to God, if he's, like, next... Like, very close to this uh, village elder and we piss the village elder, he's like, Go look for him! Who knows? He could be anywhere. Hmm... Carl of Wurchag, where the fuck are you, buddy? Who's the guy next to him? Uh. Hi, sir. Uh. Alright, she said the same thing as the village elder. You're all very useful. Glad I- glad I've talked to you all. Like, a armor, a guy who's clad in some of the finest armor you've ever seen, and who's parked an army of 80-some-odd men just outside, is saying he's looking for a criminal, and you can't be like, so oh, people come and go. Are you kidding me? Yeah, let's follow this road. Maybe there's like a cave or something that he's like hiding in. Though I highly doubt it. Doesn't look like it. All right, I'll go back. Where is this guy? You bastards! I swear to God. Stop hiding your garbage from me. Hello, Tarl. I'm here not to capture you, but I want to be your your friend. Hey, is it? Are you Tarl? No. I highly doubt you are just walking around. Oh my god, this is frustrating. What about down here? What's over here? This unnatural looking divot in the land. Nothing. Alright. Oh, oh! This looks like somebody's like might be hiding in the corner over here. You look like you have a weapon too. All right, what? What do you mean? All right, whatever. Hey, buddy. Uh, look for a murder by the entire Warchig. Is that you? I think you've got the wrong man. Then drop your sword. If you are innocent, you have nothing to fear. We'll go now and talk to your neighbors. Uh. Uh, let's see. Die, dog. Well, I'm glad I got the first strike. Dude, you- like, really? Okay, well I got him. 
Cool, we did it. We can leave now. Glad that went well. As well as it did anyway. Um, Are we at war with the Rodox? Wow, the Rodox are effing gigantic. Though the Nords are pretty fucking big too. Swadia. Poor Swadia. Alright. Well, with that being done, we can actually turn this in now and do something with it. Let's keep moving. How many enemies? I'm thinking it's like the hero here. Yikes. So many dudes. So many dudes. Help. Help. Sir, help me. Sea Raider landing. Hey. Yeah, you go take care of them. I'm looking for the Jarl. Who I think might actually be the king, technically. And I just kind of stumbled across him. And that went really well. Uh... Well, I mean, we're part of the Nords at this point, right? We might as well. All right, King of Swati's got too many, too much shit to deal with. Can I actually jump in here? Uh, wasn't it? Who's this guy? This guy likes me a lot. I was gonna help him, but. Let's go ahead and take a hostile action. And, well, do what we must. AKA, make some money. I'd love to level up. Really would. I don't think they could do anything about me doing, like, looting the hell out of them either. Yay, exquisite butter. I'll take butter. Money is money. Thanks, guys. Oh, hey, I looted it right as you took it, too. You're welcome. Why did you attack innocent villages, my dear sir? When you thought it protect me, I wouldn't expect you to act as a village elder would. Oh, I'm sorry. Don't get mad. I need to get you some armor or something, too. I'm curious how useful you are. Oh, Dirum? Hey, look, Dirum's part of the Hoden Nords. That's like home to me, almost. Enemies on the horizon? Well, they're done. Uh, it's Lord Cly. I fucking hate him anyway. Oh, that didn't last long. And he got taken prisoner. That's hilarious. Let's go to the, uh, not the tavern. Uh, let's go to the marketplace. Not the arena. <laughs> let's go to the marketplace, sell our stuff off. Continue. Go to the armor merchant, sell all of our well-made and exquisite butters. Maybe get some sweet armor out of this, because we're making a lot of money. He actually can't take anymore. Um, what do we got? This is 40 and 16. Mine's still slightly better. 47, 52. Yeah, all this stuff is not as good as what I'm wearing right now. Though this is, and so is, this is, well, well, 35 actually. No, it's not. All right, I've got some good stuff. Go to the horse merchant, sell off the rest of the butter. There you go, buddy. And call it a day. We'll wrap this episode up. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling real good. We're in a good position. We're finally with a kingdom that is not shit. And we'll hopefully be able to make something of it. Um, Jarl... Turagar. So he is not the king. Because there's another Jarl there. But anyway, thank you guys for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, come back tomorrow. More Mountain Blade Warband. And consider dropping a like. It helps me out a great deal. And as always, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.